And from 1979 to 2012, 39 children have died under the age of 19 from soccer goals falling on them. And in the first 20 years, 20, 25 years, it was around one, a little less than one kid per year was, was being killed. But as soccer has gotten more popular in the last few years, it's been two to three kids a year have been killed. All these kids are getting up there and swinging on them, they're falling. You know, it's an aluminum goal, it's only 230 pounds. But what's happened is, you know, my kids are playing soccer now and I've never been more aware and cautious and conscious of what's going on. But they put these anchors, they move the goals a lot because they got to mow the grass. And people get lazy and they don't want to put the anchors, the proper anchorings down on them. Or they've got old sandbags that you go and pick up and they've rotted and it just breaks so they don't do anything to do about it, right? Or it's grass is growing up over the sandbags, you can't find them anymore. So there's several different types of ways to anchor a field. You know, you get what you pay for. You get a good quality UV protected sandbag, you know, it's not going to break down. It's not going to weather as quickly. Or a, a dense, a durable, like you see over there, can, canvas sandbag. It's going to be durable and it's not going to break down, but it, and it's, at the same time, it's going to anchor that field. Permanent ones that can screw into the ground. You can open up a cap, put a lock on it so the kids or whoever can't take it off. Different size screws, smaller ones, anything you can do to anchor a field is going to improve the stability of the safety of that thing. We've even got neat ones for synthetic turf. You can go in, put a little slice in the carpet, slide this in underneath, anchor it, put a, put a master lock on it. Even if the goal falls a little bit, you might cause a little tenting or something on the turf, but if it doesn't fall all the way down, it's going to be safe and the kid's not going to be hurt. Last year in Arkansas, a high school kid, goalie, goal wasn't anchored, family's there, everyone's watching the game, a wind gust came, blew the goal over, got him right in the back of the neck, and he right there died right there in front of his family and friends. So, you know, it's really important that the safety is done. And so what we're going to see here is, got six sandbags, properly anchoring a goal, we got 405 pound pendulum, it's a lot of 12 year olds that could be up there swinging, right? We can show a little demonstration here. You can see the arch, you can see it, it's stressing it, it's pulling it, it's wanting to pull it down, but it's not taking it down, right? 